Hi hey everybody, it's Kathy. How's everybody doing today? Today I'm going to do something that I've seen a lot of people, well, as soon as I get down enough where you can see me. Um, not a lot of people, but a few people doing, and it's called um, a brookie. It's a cross between a cookie and a brownie. So um, I'm going to use chocolate fudge Pillsbury brownie mix. And then it calls for two thirds, or excuse me, one quarter cup of water, but I'm gonna substitute um, milk the water. Mm. This container's almost full, it's hard to hold on to. How's the weather where you are? We, uh, we're having snow well, the last four or five hours, but not heavy, and it stopped and the sun's coming out, so that's a good sign. And I have to get my oil. Sorry about that. And what did I say for oil? Two thirds cup. So one third. I'm using canola. Two thirds. And it also calls for two eggs. Whenever you use eggs, of course, they should be room temperature. And I always break them in another bowl just to make sure of two things. One, that there's no shells. And two, that the egg is not spoiled. I've had that happen to me. Not recently, but I've had that happen to me. Okay, that's water milk instead of water, the two eggs, and the oil, and I'm just going to break the eggs up a little bit and then put them in the mixture. There we go. I don't know if you noticed, it says GU on my apron. GU is Grand Union. I don't know if anybody remembers Grand Union. Yeah, yeah, it was, it was a nice store. It was a nice company. I worked there for 22 years, and, um, they went out of business, and uh, kind of as the story goes, I didn't get a replacement position, but I got the apron. <laughs> um, yeah, that was a long time ago. They went out in um, 2001, and uh, I, like I said, I, it was a nice place to work. I managed a cheese shop. I love that. I did that for, while well, I was with them for 22 years. I did that for about 19 of the 22 years. And I also helped out in the deli when they needed relief for lunches. And um, that was okay too. I didn't mind that because I had prior um, deli experience with a small deli around um, here in my neighborhood uh, before that. But I went to Grand Union in 1979. Um, and that's where they put me. They started me out there, but then when they expanded and started putting different departments in, um, you had to apply to see if you could get into one of those departments, a bakery or seafood, or um, the, they call them specialized departments, or the cheese shop. And the cheese shop also did uh, cut a fresh pasta, made pizzas. Um, they did a, a lot of different things in there. Um, everything changed from season to season and um, then they moved they were in the um, Imperial Plaza on the corner and then, and then they moved 
um, over on the other side where um, now it's called uh, Job Lot. And um, yeah, I think it's Job Lot, yeah. And uh, they, Job Lot never did anything with it. It's, it's exactly, it looks exactly the same. As you go in, it's the same, um, everything. They, they really didn't change anything. So I guess that's just the way they work. Okay, now your oven is supposed to be 350. And I heard my oven go off. Um, as the saying goes, I heard that a long time ago from Rachel Ray. Um, you shouldn't be waiting your, for your oven. Your oven should be waiting for you. And it's true, but I don't, uh, I'm not 100% on that. There's sometimes when I'm waiting because I forgot to put the oven on. Now, what you're doing with this is, it's supposed to be, I've changed it to cupcakes. It's supposed to be a brownie. And uh, on top of the brownie, you put little bits of chocolate chip cookies. Um, the Pillsbury roll type. I'm going to do it um, as cupcake and still do the, the cookie on top. And we'll see how that comes out. I don't know if that'll be any better or any worse. Um, I, I never tried it before, even though I'd heard about it, but um, it sounds um, a bit decadent. Um, but, you know, everything's worth trying at least once, right? It's very thick and very fudgy, so it should be very good. Uh, the only problem with that is there's a lot of things here desserts and savory dishes that I've made for my household and uh, I end up being the only one that likes it or the only one that ends up eating it or you know and I hate to throw anything away but um, I can't imagine that will happen with this I will um, make it a point to give some away if uh, that's the case I don't even know that I'm gonna get um, I might be putting too much in here that I'm going to get uh, 12 brownies out of this. We'll see. Oh, there goes Brady. He hears or sees something and he looks at everything. Well, I guess that's his job. He's uh, our year and a half golden doodle. Our troublemaker. the telephone. Whoever it is, we'll call back. Hello. Please leave a message after the call. And we'll have to edit that. That's alright. Those things happen. The barking? Um... No, the telephone, because I'm doing the video. Oh, I'm sorry. Okay. Yeah, this really is thick. We oh. And I think one more should do it. a bit more in that one. That one's a little on the low side. Okay, good. I got uh, some on me, of course. You can't bake unless you show what you're baking all over your body. Okay, let's move this over now, and I'm going to cut the slices off of our chocolate chip cookies. It's Toll House, so again, that should be very good. And uh, when I heard it being done, they said they put um, thick slices of cookie on it. And then when it was done, it uh, they thought that it was probably too thick. So I'm going to 
try and just do a bit and uh, we'll go from there. And yeah, that's uh, all we got out of it was 12. I thought for sure we'd probably get more like 18. But, so I'll put a piece there and a piece there. dough. I've never eaten it, but I know people who do. And they also made a big deal out of that, and that's why we have cookie dough everything. Okay, that's it. Now we're going to stick it in the oven. Oh, I'm going to do about 25 minutes because it's not, um, it's not the brownie style. And I don't want to overcook it. All right, that's what we got. In the oven. Set the oven for 25 minutes. And I'll be back, 25 minutes.